What is up guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'm going to show you how you can get the latest android version by samsung the android 7.1.1 on your galaxy j5 2015 now as you can see i'm running android oreo over here that doesn't matter if you want the video about that please press the i button over here but as our j5 2015 is getting old and it's not getting no good update as of the newer devices such as the 2016 one i'm going to show you how you can do it unofficially but in order to do that you will need to install a custom recovery on your phone so you have to you just download that from the description below and just follow this tutorial first of all power off your device for that you have to just now hold on power home and volume down together until you see this now once you see this you have to just press volume up and just hop onto the pc once you are on the pc you have to just download odin and the recovery file for your j5 2015 here is my odin let's just fire it up now my device is showing over here as you can see as i have connected it to my pc you also have to install samsung usb drivers if you see nothing over here you have to select ap and just search for your recovery file there you go just select open and go to the options and uncheck auto reboot come back to the log and hit start and you're basically done you have successfully installed recovery on your j5 Hold on your home, power and volume up at the same time until you see some lines on the top just like that. Sorry for the weird brightness but as you can see this recovery is bit different. So it has the aroma installer and this recovery also supports marshmallow. So if you are coming from the marshmallow update just like me, you will not have any kind of screen glitches as before. Now you have to just go to wipe, advanced wipe, dial week catch, system, catch, data, preload, persist and you don't have to wipe anything else than that like internal storage or the micro sd card that's not needed at all just swipe to wipe it will take around few seconds go to home install now i will leave a link in the description for two roms one will be bit of a few mods and optimization than the stock port so it's your choice whether you want just the stock without any mods or with the mods so i'm going to show you the rom with some mods so here you go winter serenity edition just swipe to wipe it will take you through aroma installer just tap next agree next next and as we have just done the format choose save format next if you want more ram you can just select nothing at all over here but i want the full experience so i'm just selecting everything you can have and services or not that's your choice but i won't say this installing the sony apps over here besides that everything is useful next mine is j5f as you can see you will have choice for fn fm and the h so yeah there is quite a lot of choice over here mine is f so yeah next i don't want root otherwise you have an option for magics and the super issue which is quite nice next device is now successfully updating to the android version 7.1.1 just after a minute it has been successfully installed let's just tap next and reboot the system your phone will now boot into the setup directly it will take around 5 minutes as this is a very old device so after around 2 to 3 minutes the rom has been finally been booted so let's just set up our phone sorry for the brightness start agree to all next 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 not now let's just select next samsung account later on skip finish and there you go you have successfully installed android 7.1 nougat on your j5 2015 now if you are wondering where this rom is coming from so if you don't already know j5 2015 yup 2015 actually have nougat update but that's not bootable onto our phone which is the j5 2015 fh or anything that you have so this rom has been ported from the indian version of the 2016 and it just works flawless there are almost no bugs at all there is volty and all the stuff working now there is one bug as if right now which is soon to be fixed which would be the video recording in camera so that's the only issue as we are in the camera there you go you have hdr auto again you have your mode such as pro mode which is just a standard one you have beauty face you have hdr rich tone and all other stuff just like before then you can also zoom in like galaxy a set coming to the home screen as you can see there is the all new galaxy a set ui it is your newer notification panel initial impressions it's water smooth like literally it doesn't feel like a three-year-old device by now then again here is your menu and as we selected all the apps we have all the apps from the galaxy a set as you can see my files and stuff you also have recent files option which are some hidden features that had been enabled in this specific rom and then again you have normal stuff from the j5 2016 there's messages and stuff there you go apps open fairly quick now going to the settings you have all the new features from the nougat such as going to the display your outdoor mode as before then you have screen zoom and font which have been added onto the dream ux you also have the icon frames just like the galaxy asset and the normal stuff 
then you have all new device maintenance you don't get ultra data saving which is a bit weird over here but yeah like if you agree with me it just doesn't do much of the stuff then you have high performance mode over here yep it has been ported from the galaxy a set on to a certain extent i don't know how much it works but it should give a little bit touch boost as i've seen on other devices you have battery and you also get s power planning from the prime series which is also nice so this is actually specific to this rom as it's not a j5 2016 feature you have forward calls on no battery very nice stuff you also get advanced features for example you have game tools and game launcher like this is an extremely feature packed rom for a very old device you have multi window which is just the normal stuff into the android nougat then you have dual messenger go to software info as you can see android version 7.1.1 and experience version 8.5 so you are getting the latest and the greatest from the galaxy noted over here i mean agreed our galaxy s8 is on the oreo beta but this is not bad at all it runs butter smooth for a older device like this and just it has all the features such as your asset apps then the camera features the dual messenger the game launcher it just has everything so yeah guys that's pretty much it thanks for watching this was a quick little video on how you can update your galaxy j5 2015 to android nougat hope you guys enjoyed and see you in the next one peace